don't know where I'm at. Oh, hello? Hi, Mario. Oh, hey, baby. You ready to hang out? Yeah. Uh, come on inside. Yay! So what do you want to do? You want to watch TV or? What's that noise, Mario? I, I don't know. I just ignore it. Uh, you want to watch TV? Uh, do you mind if I use the restroom real quick? I mean, sure, but you try to use the... Oh, whatever. Mario! Whoa, what's wrong, baby? Did you know Jeffy was locked in the bathroom for hours? What? Jeffy locked in the bathroom for hours? I, I had no idea, baby. Poor Jeffy. Yes, you did know I was locked in the bathroom because you came up and slapped the door and you said, shut up, little shit. What? Well, I, I didn't know such thing. Jeffy's lying. I did not know he was locked in the bathroom, baby. I had no idea. How could you not hear him? Well, I mean, I, I thought all that screaming was the, the neighbors or, or a lawnmower. Oh, you know, that does make sense. Yeah, lawnmowers make a really loud screaming noise. You know, say, daddy, you know. Well, Mario, we need a way for him to contact us in case he gets into trouble again. What, what do you have in mind? I have no idea. He could just scream louder, you know? Uh, we could get him a cell phone. What? No, we're not getting Jeffy a cell phone. Why not, Mario? Look at him. He's not responsible enough to get a cell phone. He's an idiot. He, he might call the cops all the time and, and, and make random calls and be a no... I'm, I'm not getting him a cell phone. It's, well, it's a bad idea. What else are we going to do, Mario? Well, I mean, a cell phone is too expensive and he's not responsible and... I have an idea. I have a perfect idea. I have a perfect idea. Hold on, just stay right here. Okay, how about this? Walkie-talkies. Walkie-talkies? Really, Mario? Yes, it's better than a cell phone. He's not responsible enough to have a cell phone, so a walkie-talkie's easy. All you do is press a button, and he can talk to me. He's always within, like, 15 feet of me, so, you know, a walkie-talkie's perfect. I don't know. Just trust me, baby. Trust me. Okay. All right, Jeffy. So here's your walkie-talkie. Walkie-talkie? Yeah, it's a walkie-talkie. All you do, if you want to contact me, uh, you just press this little green button right here, and you can talk to me. Like, immediately. All right? Press the green button and talk to Dad? Yeah, you press the green button and you talk into it, and I'll be right there just to answer you, okay? So, so go in your room and try it. Okay. Go in your room and try it. Jeffy, stop. Don't do that. <coughs> Jeffy, stop that. <coughs> Jeffy? <coughs> stop it. Stop doing that. <coughs> Jeffy? <coughs> How do you turn this off? I don't know. Ah, uh, uh, it's not working. How do you turn it off? Jenny! Stop it! Okay, fine. We'll get him a cell phone. We'll get him a cell phone, okay? Let's go. Okay, Jeffy, me and Rosalina have made the tough decision to buy you a cell phone. A cell phone? Yes, a cell phone. Show it to him. Look, Jeffy, you flip it open like that. Wow. Yeah, it's really cool. It's kind of like the walkie-talkie, but less annoying. Give it to him, give it to him. Here you go. What am I doing this? Uh, you can make phone calls with it. You put it up to your ear and your mouth. Put it in my mouth? Yeah, you can put it not in your mouth. Hey, Jeffy! Hey, don't taste good, Dad. Why are you doing that, Jeffy? Back to the store! We have to go back to the store! Okay. I told you not to buy a cheap phone. Uh, all right, Jeffy. I just got back from the store and I decided to get you an iPhone, okay? An iPhone? Yes, an iPhone. Does I it go on my eye? No! It doesn't, it doesn't go in your eye, it doesn't go in your nose or your mouth or your Aww. ears. It's just a phone, so you take it. What am I doing this, Dad? Open it. How? Swipe. Swipe. Okay, look, see, look. look. Here's my number. I already put it in there. Me, that's Mario. Rosalina, that's her. Five rights. What? Five rights at the top. That's favorites, Jeffy. Well, what's your favorite? It's your, it's your three. It's the only three people you can call. Look, me, Rosalina, or nine one one. So you and mommy are my favorite. Yeah, you're. Yes, we're, we're your favorites and nine one one. Who's nine one one? It's the cops. <gasps> you only the call the cops. You only I can't get to call your wee woo dad. You don't get to call them. Why? You you're only put your number on my phone. You only call. Are you sure this is still a good idea? I I'm sure it'll work, Mario. Look, look, Just trust him. Look, look. Do not call the cops unless you call me or Rosalina first. But only you only call us during emergencies, okay? So I have to call it in this order? Yes, you have to call it in and that order. And then I get to talk to the wee woo. Yeah, you only get to talk to the cops if, if me and Rosalina do not answer, okay? Okay, dang. Okay, so take the phone and just scram. You know, good to go. Yeah, there you go. Okay, fine. Okay. He'll be fine, Mario. I Wait, promise. Are you sure? I'm sure. Okay, let's 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 watch that movie. Let's watch Star Wars. Let me go get it. Okay, the movie's put in, so you ready to watch Star Wars? Yes, Star Wars. What oh my god, who is that Jeffy texting me? What is he what does he want? Jeffy! We're watching a movie! Stop te Stop texting me! Jeffy! You, you know what? I'm just gonna ignore him. I'm just gonna ignore him. Let's watch the movie, Mario. Okay. 
Oh, okay, I'll just start the movie. Just, you know, press. Jimmy, stop texting me! Oh, now he's calling. What, what does he want? No, I'm just ignoring it. I'm ignoring it. I'm ignoring it. Oh, look, Mario. What? Jimmy sent me pictures. Is that bleach? Oh, Ew. he's so sweet. It's calling me again. What, what does he want? What does he want? Oh my God, it, it's a stupid phone. Uh, Jimmy, what do you want? What, doing? Jimmy, stop calling me. You're in the other room. We can hear you. Why? Jimmy, Jimmy, just we're trying to watch a movie. Please, just just go play a game on your phone. Game on my phone? Y yes, yes. Play a game on your phone. We're trying to watch a movie. Okay. Only call Why? me for emergency. Why? Jimmy, just please don't call me again. Okay. Aww. Yes, bye. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Let's watch the movie, okay? Okay. <sighs> Aww. If Daddy doesn't want me calling him, who am I supposed to call? I guess I'll just call one of my friends. <sighs> Thank you for calling Pizza Hut. Can I get your phone number starting with your area code, please? What is it? What is it? It's in the air horn? What is wrong with you? It's an air horn. I know what it is. Ah. Call the my is here. Hey, do you sell pets there? Do we sell who? Pets. Yes. Do you have goldfish? Yes. I like goldfish. Do you have kitty okay. cats there? I like kitty cats too. I have one. You want to hear it? You want to hear my kitty cat? No, I ain't got time for that. Meow, 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 meow. Thank you for calling Applebee's. This is Chelsea. Can I help you? Hey, um, this is really embarrassing, but I'm stuck in your bathroom and there's no toilet paper. Oh my god. Alright, um, I'll send somebody in there to give me some, okay? Please hurry. It's starting to itch. Hi, thanks for calling Domino's on Nine Mile. This is Josh. Is this going to be for delivery or carry out? Oops, wrong number. Oh, you're fine. Hi, thanks for calling Domino's on Nine Mile. This is Josh. Is this going to be for delivery or carry out? Oops, wrong number. Josh, is this going to be for delivery or carry out? Oops, wrong number. Can you, uh, can you stop calling this number then? I just got the wrong number, I'm sorry. Okay, so whenever you punch the number next time, don't push in this number. Okay. Okay, thank you, have a good day. Domino's on nine miles. This is Josh. Is this going to be for delivery or carry out? Oops, wrong number. Can can you stop calling this number because you called six times and it's the same number. So you're going to have to punch in a different number if you want to get the number that you're trying to reach. I'm really trying to write the right number down. Hey, how's it going today? My name is Us. How can I help you? Oops, wrong number. I'm looking for Josh. Oh, the rest, I help you. Hey, is Mr. Wall there? Mr. Wall? Yeah. Nobody by that name um, works here. Um, what about Mrs. Wall? Is she there? No. Oh, uh, well, how does your ceiling stand up? Well said. How does your ceiling stand up if no walls are there? Are you a prostitute? <laughs> of course I am. What's your name? My name's Mario. Can you touch my pee pee for five dollars? Oh, I love lightsaber battles. What? Who, who could that be? I don't know. Uh, let's, let's go answer it. Okay. Hello? Hi. I'm looking for Mario, thumb guy. We spoke on the phone. What? Mario, who is this woman? I, I have no idea. I, I've never seen this girl in my life. We spoke on the phone. I was supposed to touch your pee-pee for $5, so let's get this over with. What? Mario, you cheating bastard! I'm not doing this! I'm not doing anything! Do Hi, this is Mario. Can you touch my pee-pee for $5? Yes,
questions, Daddy. You're now on the Jeffy Game Show. And if you answer this one question correctly, then you have to buy me the new PlayStation 5 and the new Xbox Series X. I don't want to play. Well, too bad, Daddy. The first question is, what color is my helmet? Red. No, you just changed your helmet. No, no. Mario, you said he had a red helmet on. Now he's wearing a red helmet. Well, no, it was blue and he just changed. It doesn't count. Well, Danny, I don't make the rules. I just follow them. Well, I'm not buying you the new PlayStation or the new Xbox. Just wait till Christmas. Christmas? That's like next month. I don't even know if I'll be alive by then. You'll be alive next month. I know. Mario, that's true. The sun could explode tomorrow. Yeah, and if the sun explodes, then I don't know what it's like to have a PlayStation 5 or a brand new Xbox. Box. Well, no one will know because if the sun explodes, we'll all be dead. So no one will care. Look, Jeffy, look, Christmas is next month and you have to be good because Santa Claus is watching. Oh, Santa Claus is watching? Well, what about this, Santa Claus? I got a big diaper full of Jeffy, shit. Jeffy, that's it. You're grounded. Grounded? What did I do? Mario, how about we make him a good boy chart? Well, what's a good boy chart? Here, look. Every time Jeffy does something good, we put a gold star on the chart. And when he has 25 gold stars, he gets a prize. G good idea, baby. He'll never do 25 good things, so he'll never get a prize. Mario, that's not the point. <laughs> Jeffy, look. Uh, we got you a good boy chart. Good boy chart? Yeah, good boy chart. If you do 25 good things, I'll buy you one of the new systems. 25 good things? I might as well just wait till Christmas. Then wait till Christmas. What no, Daddy? Tell me what the 25 good things are. Okay, you, you have to do good things like you can't be annoying, you can't poop your pants, ooh, and uh, you can't break stuff. Well, I haven't broken anything all day, so gold star. Oh, I'll go get the gold stars. What, no. All right, Jeffy, there's your first gold star. I got a star? Daddy, that is the tits. And you lost your gold star. I lost it? What did I do? You said a bad word. That's a bad word? Most people would say that's a good word. Jeffy, look, you can't say bad things. You can't do bad things. You can only do good things to get gold stars. Well, Daddy, my butt's mad at you. So you better gotta listen to what he's gotta say. <sighs> Jeffy, that is disgusting. Look, you can only do good things, so start doing good things. Okay, well, what good things do you want me to do then, Daddy? One, take the microphone out of your pants. Okay, next, go clean the entire kitchen, and you'll get a gold star. All right. Well, this might actually be a good thing if he starts doing good stuff. Yo, 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 Mario, what's up, folks? What's up, Black Yoshi? Yeah, man, I know you see that new PlayStation 5, you know the PS6 one? Yeah, I saw it. And the new Xbox. Yeah. Well, my pockets run a little thin this month, so I was wondering if you'd be done slide me that Thowie so I can get the consoles. I don't have a Thowie. Owie! Look, Black Yoshi, I'm not going to buy you any of the systems. I'm going to have to buy Jeffy one if he finishes his good boy chart. Good boy chops? <laughs> what's that about, folks? Well, if Jeffy gets 25 gold stars, I told him I'd buy him one of the systems. Well, why don't I get some good boy chops? Because you just don't get one. Well, hold up, folks. <laughs> <What? laughs> Mario, take this out right here. This is my own good boy chops. And instead of 25 stars, I got 50 stars on there. Like the American flag. <laughs> I'll play the Libra to the good boy chops, to the United States, or give me both the consoles. Black Yoshi, what good things have you done? Uh, I be done checks the mail. What, uh, that, that's why my mail was stolen. Oh, yeah, your grandma be sent you $5 for your birthday, but I already be done spimps it. Like, that's a federal offense. Mario, I don't care what type of filth it is. If it's a picket fence, a huckleberry fence, the Miami doll fence. Look, you're not getting any of the systems. I don't care if you have a good boy chart. Well, fine then, folks. You green. I'm just gonna take my chart somewhere else. Maybe I'll take it to the Walmart and they can see how good I've been. And maybe they just give me the console free. <sighs> Oh man, I don't want to clean all these dishes. Hey Jeffy, what are you doing? I'm about to have to clean the kitchen so I can get a gold star. What happens if you get a gold star? Well, I get to get all the new systems. But really? Yeah. We want to see my new toy that I just got? Heck yeah, Junior. All right, turn off all the lights. All right. All right, Jeffy, check this out. It's a lightsaber. Junior, that is the tits. I know, right? It's a real lightsaber. Sure, if I touch it, my fingers are gonna come off? Yeah. What, liar? Well, you must be made out of armor or something. Yeah, yeah, maybe. I am the BFD with the BFD. Yeah, so what if instead of cleaning those dishes, you got rid of those dishes like a Sith? Oh, heck yeah, Junior, heck! Yeah, here, use your Jedi powers to clean those dishes. All right, Junior. All right, Jeffy, the dishes are all lined up for you. Dishes? I am your father. Yeah. 
You showed those dishes. Well, I sure did, Junior. Whoa, Jeffy, look at the big mess you made. I know, Junior, it's so sick. Ooh, you made a big old mess. Now I'm gonna go tell your daddy. Oh, please don't go tell my daddy. I'm supposed to be being a good boy and get the gold star so I can get the new systems. Well, hey, if you help me get the new PlayStation 5, then uh, I won't tell your daddy that you made a big old mess. So, this is what the plan gonna be. So what you gonna do is, you gonna go steal the gold stars and put it all over your good boy card, and then you gonna take that card to your mama. You gonna tell your mama that your daddy gave you the stars, and then she gonna buy you the Xbox. Then you take that same card and take it to your daddy, and then you tell your daddy that your mama gave you the stars, and then he gonna buy you the PlayStation. And then you give the PlayStation to me. Oh, that idea sounds pity. Well, when do I get a system? You don't. Aww. All right, so go steal the star and get a card to your mom. All right. Oh, my stomach's rumbling. I'm really hungry. Oh, me too. Hey, since Jeffy's cleaning the kitchen, I can go get us some food. Yeah, you should definitely go get us some food. Okay, well, what are you in the mood for? McDonald's. Definitely McDonald's. Oh, McDonald's. We always get McDonald's. But I love McDonald's. And just don't tell Jeffy we're getting McDonald's because I don't want him to eat any of it. Why is that? Because I want him to eat healthy. Oh, well, okay. Well, I'll be right back then. All right. Oh, hey, Mommy. What is it, Jeffy? Oh, before you leave, I cleaned the kitchen so good that Daddy gave me all the stars on my good boy <gasps> chart. He did! Jeffy, I'm so proud of you! Yeah, thanks, Mommy. Oh, I am pretty proud of it. Oh, but when you go out, can you go ahead and get me my Xbox? I will, Jeffy! I will! Oh, sweet, Mommy. Thanks. Yeehaw, Daddy, guess what? what? Jeffy, why are you talking like that? We're out there good, good boy chart full of stars. Jeffy, stop talking like that. What are you saying? Well, Daddy, I cleaned the kitchen so good that Mommy go ahead and gave me all the stars. But she's not supposed to do that. She's only supposed to give you one star for cleaning the kitchen. Well, now you gotta go get me my PlayStation. Well, Jeffy, no, explain to me what each star was for. All right, well, the first star, because I cleaned one dish, then I cleaned two dishes, what? and then I cleaned three dishes, and then I clean four dishes. No, you don't. Then I clean five dishes. You don't get a star per all dish. All the way down to 25 dishes. Oh, oh, you know what, Jeffy? Fine, listen. I will go ahead and buy you one game system, but only one. But on Christmas morning, when you wake up and there's no other presents, what are you going to think? That there's no Santa Claus? No, no, because I'm giving you a Christmas gift today. So when I get you your one game system right now, that means it's all you're getting for Christmas, okay? So wh which, which system do you want right now? Uh, the PlayStation 5. All right, I'm going to go get it, but that's all you're getting. Good. Oh, folk, it's working, folk! Uh-huh. Uh, uh. All right, Jeffy, here's your PlayStation 5. Daddy, this is cool as... Jeffy, do not say that word. Look, here, just take your PlayStation 5. Merry Christmas. And a happy new year. Jeffy, go! Take it. Jeffy, I have your Xbox! Mother, that is the bosoms. Thank you for being such a good boy, Jeffy. Oh, I'm the bestest boy ever. Enjoy. Thanks, mother. No, 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 this ain't right. What's wrong? They went ahead and got us the digital dishes or the PS5 and the Xbox, so they went cheap on us. Is that bad? Yeah, it's bad. Because what happens if our Wi-Fi goes out? Then we can't access our games. So we need the ones with the disc dishes. So what we need to do is, I got some plan. We're going to go downstairs, and we're going to break both of these consoles so they have to take it back and get us the better ones. So come on, let's go. All right, Jeffy, so what we're going to do is we're going to break them, and then you're going to take them back to your parents and tell them that they came like that. Then they're going to take them back to the store, and then they're going to exchange them for the good ones. All right. All right, so I'm going to hit this egg bar with the hammer. Are right, you ready? Here we go. <coughs> I got an even better idea. All right, folks, we're gonna throw the Xbox out the balcony. Here we go. <laughs> that I'll do it. All right, let me get the PlayStation. All right, right here. PlayStation 5 is next. Bye-bye. <laughs> Let's go check it out, folks. Oh, 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 yeah, folks. They broke it. So now what you gotta do is you gotta take them to your parents and then tell them they came like this. All right. Mario, I'm back. Oh, good. I'm starving. Where's the food? <gasps> Mario, I completely forgot. I was just so excited about Jeffy being such a good boy. I mean, he was a good boy, right? Yeah, right? I mean, he cleaned the kitchen, right? Yeah, right? Um, Mommy, uh, I need to talk to you in the other room in private. Oh. It's an emergency. Okay, Jeffy. 
All right. All right, mommy. So I was getting ready to play the Xbox, and I was so excited. And I opened up the box, and it looked like this. Oh no, Jeffy, it's broken. Yeah, and I read online that all the digital Xboxes are broken. So when you take it back, I think you need to ask for the one with the disc because uh, those are stronger. Oh, Jeffy, I'm so sorry I got the wrong one. I'll go to the store right now, return it, and get the right one, okay? Oh, oh thank you so much, mommy. I appreciate it. Oh, Daddy! What? It's awful! What? Play the shot, old yeller! What are you talking about, Jeffy? Daddy, I was getting ready to play my new PS5. I was so excited. And I opened up the box and it was broken! What, broken? Yeah, and I read online that all the digital PS5s are broken when you open them up. Well, well, so then what am I supposed to get? Well, you're supposed to get the one with the disc player. I heard those are stronger and they don't break. And they're not broken when you when you get them. What? It looks like this thing just snapped back on. It doesn't. It, well, 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 let me try it. No, it doesn't. Let, let me try it. Okay, it was dropped off a balcony. What? I mean, it looks like it was dropped off a balcony. I don't know what they're doing over there at Sony. But. Uh, okay, well then, I'll try to... Okay, I'll return it and get you the one that can play disc if this one came broken. Okay. All right, thanks, Daddy. <sighs> Jeffy, I got your PlayStation 5. Jeffy, I got your Xbox. What? Baby, why'd you get him an Xbox? Why did you get him a PlayStation 5? He said you gave him 25 gold stars. He said you gave him 25 gold stars. I didn't. I didn't. Well, uh, 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 oh. Jeffy, that's it. You're grounded. You lied to us. Father, please don't raise your voice at me. No, don't talk to me in that British voice. It's not going to work this time. You lied to us so that you get both systems. Well, only one of the systems is for me. Then who's the other system for? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, you got the PS5? Oh, I can't wait to play it. No, you're not playing the PS5. We're going to return these consoles. Jeffy, you're grounded. What am I grounded too, Daddy? Yeah, you're grounded too. You know what? Actually, I think I'm going to play the PlayStation 5. Oh, I think I'm going to play the Xbox. What? <laughs> yep, we're going to play these systems because we bought them. And you guys can just sit back and watch and be grounded. Come on, baby. Let's play these systems. Come on. <laughs> oh, man, this PlayStation 5 is so fun. This is so much fun, Mario. Yeah. Oh. So guys, what do you want to do today? I don't know, Junior. Whatever you want to do. I don't know, dude. I think I just want to go home. But why? I don't feel too good. Well, you can go lay in my room. Nah, I think I just want to go and lay in the grass, get bit by ants. What? Cody, that was weird. What? Like, he's homeless. Like, why would he want to go home? Like, he has no home to go to. Well, we went to his house that one time. Yeah, and would you want to go there? No, no, I never want to go there again. Yeah, like, that's just really weird that Joseph wants to go home. Like, he loves staying here. There's air conditioning and food. Like... That's just really weird that he wanted to go home, like, really bad. Yeah, that's a good point. He has nowhere to go. I, I think I'm going to go follow him. Uh, uh, okay. Yeah, you want to come with me? N no, no, Junior, that's weird. I, I think I'll just stay here in your house while you're not here. Uh, okay, I'm going to go follow him. I'll let you know what happens. Okay. What? What's in here? <laughs> where, where, where am I? Trace, where's my towel? Here's your towel, sir. Oh, it took so long. Wait, the towel isn't even heated. All right, sir, I'm sorry. I'll fetch you another. Oh, don't even worry about it, Ty. I'll just air dry like a poor person. What? God. Joseph? Wait, Junior, what are you doing here, dude? Well, I, I followed you and I went inside the bush and I came out that slide. What? what? <gasps> George, Joseph, what is this place? Uh, it's all in imagination, dude. You're dreaming. Wake I, up! I, I'm not dreaming, Joseph. I followed you. I jumped in the same bush you did, and I showed up here in this pool. What is this place? Wait, why did you follow me, dude? I want to know where you always went, because why would you want to go home if you're poor? But it, it looks like you're not poor. What's going on? Oh, I guess you found me out. Look, just follow me to one of my rooms, and I'll explain. Okay. 
All right, dude, this is one of my favorite rooms. Whoa, you have a Pac-Man room? Yeah, dude, it's not that big of a deal. Calm down. Joseph, you said you were poor. What's going on? Yeah, remember how I told you my mom won the lottery and abandoned me? Yeah. Well, she did. Kinda. She won $100 million, then bought me a house with a private butler. Well, then where's your mom? I don't know. I don't keep up with that woman. Every time I call her, she just sends me money. She's probably traveling the world in Fiji or maybe in France. You know, show me some love, right? Well, Joseph, why would you lie to me and say you're poor? You could have told us you were rich. Because you guys will look at me as the cool friend and then will only like me for my money and then will come to my house and touch my stuff. I don't like it when people touch my stuff. And I'm pretty humble. Here's your water, sir. Ew, that's Aquafina, Ties. Oh, that's gas station water. Get me smart water. I like smart water. Very well, sir. Come on, Ties. You're the fifth one. You're expendable. Here's your smart water, sir. Oh, that's more like it. <gasps> Room temperature! Room temperature! But that's how you like it, sir. That's not what I wanted. Oh, I wanted boiling water. Boiling water, sir? Yes. But boiling water would burn your mouth, sir. Don't worry about my boiling water. Don't ask me about what I need. Oh. Very well, sir. Boiling water it is. I'm going to call my mom and get you fire ties. He's getting old, dude. Oh, Joseph, can I see the rest of your house? It's so cool. Oh, I guess so, dude. Just don't get a hard on. All right, dude. This is my game room and this is my pool table. Whoa, you have a pool table? Yeah. No, 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 no. Ah, dang it. What was wrong, Joseph? I had it perfectly aligned and you just had to touch it. Now it's ruined and I have to shut it. You don't have to sell it. I do. You got your germs on it. I'm a germaphobe. So I didn't want you coming here. Uh, I'm sorry, Joseph. Oh, it's fine, but it's not fine, but it's fine. Here's your boiling water, sir. Oh, thank you, Chives. I told you it would do that, sir. You're supposed to stop me for doing that stuff. I tried, sir. Did you? Did he do your... Y yeah, he tried to stop you. <laughs> Just give me a bad day, then, Ty. I'm sorry, sir, but what will a band-aid do for the inside of your mouth? Don't question me! Just give me a band-aid! And meet me in the operation room! You literally just told me to stop you from doing dumb stuff, sir. Just give me a band-aid and don't talk back times! Kill me. Operation room. All right, dude. This is the operation room. I come in here every time I get a boo-boo. Whoa, this is so cool, Joseph. Yeah, all right. I'm going to try to get the wishbone out. Oh, man. I hate it every time I hit the shine. Here's your band-aid, sir. It's not open, Tives. Shoop it, shoop it. Ow, sir. Get it together, Tives. Very well, sir. Oh, Joseph, you should be nicer to your butler. Maybe he should be more smart. Here's your open band-aid, sir. Oh, thank you, Chives. Now try to get the frog out of the guy's throat. And if you hit the sides, you're going to get punished. Do I absolutely have to, sir? Yes, you do! Very well. Almost. Almost there. Almost. Suck my butt, sir. Guess who's getting punished? That's not fair, sir. Oh, it is. It's time for bowling chives. I hate bowling chives. What's what bowling chives? All right, dude. Every time chives makes me mad, I put him in this ball to see if he can knock down the pins. I hate my life, sir. You should learn to listen next time. What, Joseph, this is really mean. Oh, do you want to get in the ball, Junior? What, no. All right, help me push it. Strike! That's so cool. We should go check on Chives. Why? To make sure he's okay. Oh, I guess. Whoa. Are you okay, Chives? I threw up, sir. You better clean up my ball. Very well, sir. Now, did you learn your lesson? I don't quite understand what I did wrong, sir. Well, go and get me some Oreos and think about what you did wrong while we play basketball. Very well, sir. Uh, all right, let's go and play pig, dude. All right, dude, over there is my basketball court, and this is my even bigger pool table. Whoa, you have an even bigger pool table? Yeah. <laughs> no, 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 dude. What? what? God, I had it perfectly aligned. You just had to ruin it. Now I have to sell it. Well, I'm sorry, Joseph. You don't have to keep selling them. Oh, don't worry about it, dude. Let's just go and play basketball. Let's oh. just play basketball. Okay. All right, dude, we're going to play pig. We're going to play Cody's mom? <laughs> yeah, I bet you I can make it. You can't make it from back here. Dude, watch me. Yeah. I got your... Dude, try to copy that off the backboard, off my stupid butler's face, and then in. But we should check on your butler. No, dude. Try to copy it. Okay. Uh, uh, uh. Oh. 
Wow, dude, you suck. You got a pee. Well, uh, yeah, I guess I got a pee. Well, Chives, where's my Oreos? We knocked Chives out with the basketball. Sleeping on the job, Chives? Pitiful. I'm going to call my mom. Well, I don't think he's doing okay. Oh, dude, let's go inside. It's getting dark. Okay. All right, dude, this is my movie theater. You have a movie theater? Yeah, I come in here to play video games and watch movies. That's so cool. I know, right? I think I have a concussion, sir. Oh, whose fault is that? Look, who's the butler, me or you? Me, sir. So deal with it. All right, is there anything I can get you before I die? Hmm. How about donuts? Very well, sir. Joseph, can we watch a movie? No, I don't want you touching my chairs, dude. Well, okay. Ooh, I wanted to show you the world's biggest word search. Come here, dude. Okay. Boom! It's a certificate from the Guinness Book of World Records. It's the largest word search puzzle, and it has 62,500 letters, over 10,000 words. The only word that's not on here is poor, because I'm not it. <laughs> it's so cool, Joseph. It's so big. I know. <laughs> Here's your donuts, sir. Wait, I didn't ask for donuts. You literally just asked for donuts, sir. Well, you must be getting Alzheimer's because you're obviously forgetting. I asked for a Whopper from Burger King. My bad. My ears must just not work anymore from all the yelling you do at me. Well, get a bitch! So what do you want to do now, Joseph? Ooh, you want to see another room, dude? Yeah, sure. Follow me. All right, dude, this is my Monopoly room. Whoa, that's so cool. You have a Monopoly room. That's awesome. Yeah, and the gel is over there. I throw chives in it whenever he makes me mad. Here you are, sir. Here is your Whopper from the King of Burgers. Wow, really, chives? Really? Wow, what's wrong with you? I can't even begin to fathom what could possibly be wrong now, sir. I'll give you a hint. Where's the fridge? Fries! Fries, sir? Yes, you can't eat a burger without fries! You didn't ask for any fries, sir. Wait, wait, wait. what was that? Say it in my good ear, because it sounds like you're talking back! You didn't ask for any fries, sir. Jail! You know what? Go to jail! I'm not going in there. Oh, yes, you are, for talking back to me, Ty. Now go into jail for 30 minutes. You want to know how I feel about you, sir? Well, what, explain how you feel then. Show me how you feel. Oh, oh no. You've done it now, Ty. Now go into jail for an hour. I would like to quit, sir. Oh, you're going to quit? Then how are you going to feed your family, huh? Huh? At this point, I would rather than starve, sir. Go into jail. You're going to starve today. Oh. <sighs> Show me another room, Joseph. Yeah, come on. All right, dude. This is the laser tag room. That's so cool you have a laser tag room. I know, dude. I sleep in here sometimes, and if I ever get a girl in here, we're going to try to do stuff without touching the lasers. That, that's so awesome. I want to try to touch the laser. Wait, wait, no, don't do it. I, I told you not to touch the lasers, dude. I, I, I'm sorry. I didn't know. Oh, I want a fruit by the foot. Chives! Chives! Where's Chives? You sent him to jail, remember? Oh, gosh. Let's go and get him out. Cause I got locked up, they won't let me out. Are you singing Akon again, Chives? Yes, sir. I called your name so many times and you didn't answer. Because you sent me to jail for an hour, sir. Well, get your bald 80-year-old butt out of there and get me some fruit by the foot. Very well, sir. <laughs> All right, dude, this is my Vegas room. I come in here to gamble all my money on me. That's so cool. I love how red it is. Oh, yeah, me too, dude. Here's your fruit by the meter, sir. I took the liberty of unwrapping it for you. Now, would you like me to eat it for you as well, sir? No, I think you're just trying to be a smart butt. No, sir. I'm just trying to cover all my bases before I wind up in closet prison again. <laughs> Give me my candy. Mm. It's so good, dude. I love it. <laughs> I'm choking! I'm choking! I hope you choke to death, you disgusting little turd! I was faking it! I wasn't really choking! I wanted to see if you would save me! And you did it! So you're fired! I'm free! I'm finally free! Wait, you really just fired Chives? Yeah, I can get another one like tomorrow, dude. I'm gonna call my mom. Uh, uh, okay. Joseph, are you really calling your mom? Yeah, if she answers. 
Hello, Joseph. Mommy's getting her nose job right now. Oh, hey, Mommy. I had to fire Chives. Why, Joseph? Because he doesn't listen. Well, you can't keep firing your butlers, Joseph. They're very really hard to find. Well, maybe if you came home and took care of your son like a real mom, I wouldn't have to hire a butler. Okay, Joseph, how much money do you want? 50000 Okay, baby, I transfer it to your account. Okay, fine. All right, Mommy's got to go because the anesthesia is kicking in. Love you. Bye. Whatever. What'd she say? I don't know. I hate that woman. Well, I really love your house, Joseph. Yeah, but it's not an easy life to live, dude. I think you should go home. Okay, look, I promise I won't tell Cody. I won't tell Chef Baby. I won't tell anyone about this. Oh, don't worry about it, dude. <sighs> look into this for me. Okay. Guys, what do you want to do today? I don't know, Junior. Whatever you want to do. You know what, guys? I am so poor. I am the poorest person here, and no one would ever be as poor as me. We, we understand, Joseph. We understand you're poor. Yeah, we get it. Stop bragging about yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, you're poor. We get it. Just making sure everything's back to normal. It's a masterpiece! Chef BB, how do you do it? It has to be the best meal I've ever made! Uh, Junior! Bowser! The dinner's ready! Oh man, dinner's ready! I'm starving! Wait, Chef BB, what is this? Oh, it's Blue Waffle Surprise! Blue Waffle? Waffles shouldn't even be blue! Well, I searched Blue Waffles on Google and this came up! Well, I'm not eating it! It looks disgusting! Oh, dinner's ready! Ew, Chef BB, what is that? I'm not gonna eat that! Yeah, we're not eating it, Chef PB. This is gross. Let's go and get some McDonald's, Junior. Yeah. Chef PB can't cook. Yeah, Chef PB, you can't even cook. Why are you even a chef? Just quit cooking forever. <laughs> Why? <laughs> you know what? Screw those guys. They don't know what good cooking is. People love my cooking. You know what? People would die for my cooking. I mean, die for my cooking because it's so good. You know what? I just wish a celebrity would try my food. I know they would appreciate it then. <laughs> Wait, is, is that my phone ringing? Uh, uh, uh hello? Hey, uh, is this Chef, uh, Urine? No, it's Chef Pee Pee. Oh, Pee Pee. Okay, yeah, sorry, he wrote it wrong. He, he knew it was some kind of bodily fluid, he just didn't know which one. Well, congratulations! Jason Derulo wants you to fly out to Los Angeles and be his personal chef! Wait, Jason Derulo? Yep, old rum tum tugger himself! Wait, no way! You're saying Jason Derulo wants me to fly to LA to be his personal chef? Yep, that's exactly what I said! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> well, congratulations! So, you know, just uh, head on down here whenever you can! Oh, I'm headed that way right now! Alright, great! Oh, okay, I'll be there! Cool! I'll see you soon. Yep, 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 looking forward to it. <laughs> I'm on my way. Yeah, I, I, look, I, I don't really like to hang up, so could you hang up first? Uh, goodbye. Uh, okay, bye-bye. Uh, see you later. Adios. Uh, au revoir. Sayonara. I, I'm gonna hang up now. Please do. Oh, okay. <laughs> Oh man, time for some real food! Hey Bowser! I mean loser! <laughs> I'm going to Hollywood to cook for a superstar! And I will never have to see your ugly, disgusting face again! <laughs> He'll be back. There! And if anybody comes looking for me, they'll know I made it! Dear losers, I'm going to LA to be Jason Derulo's personal chef! I'll never see your ugly faces ever again! I've made it! I'm finally rich! Chef Pee Pee the Millionaire! <laughs> Get off of my car. Oh, oh I'm so sorry, ma'am. Uh, could you do me a favor and take me to Jason Derulo's house? Uh, okay, hold on. Okay. Whee! Oh my god, I'm at Jason Derulo's house. Oh, let me knock. Hey, Chef Pee Pee! Oh, Jason Derulo! What's up, man? I'm, I'm so happy to meet you, Jason! I'm happy to meet you too, man. Chill, chill, chill. Uh, okay. Yeah, you're a little loud, the neighbors. But, but come on in, the kitchen's in here. Okay. All right, Chef Pee Pee, listen, this is my kitchen. 
Oh, it's a nice kitchen, Jason. I appreciate that, man. Um, try not to burn my house down. Okay, yeah, it's um, no problem. Yeah, and uh, just 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 try not to make the biggest mess in the world, right? You uh, know? Oh, I can't make any promises, but I'll try. I'll try. Ah, uh, uh, Okay, <laughs> it's time to get to work. <laughs> oh, what is that? D don't worry about it, Jason. It's almost done. Just give me five minutes. Oh, he's gonna like it. He's gonna like it. Okay, I need to add one more egg. Oh, oh, okay, it's a, it's a tiny mess. He, he won't see it. Uh, hey, how's it coming in there? Uh, uh, just give me one more minute, Jason. One more minute. Oh, yes. It's perfect. Uh, Jason, it's ready. What the hell happened to not making a mess? I'm sorry. I tried my best, but... I mean, if this is the trash, where's the food? It's, it's right there. It looks good, right? This? Y yes. PP, come on, bro. Like, what? What? You got Fruit Loops and spaghetti in one plate? It's a good recipe. Come on, look, it's edible. You can try it. I promise. It's I'm edible. not trying this. Why not? PP, you're fired. What? Really? No. Please, Jason, give me a chance. Please. A chance? I gave you a chance. This is what you did with your chance. Look at Jason. Come on. I know you weren't great, but this is this is crazy. I ain't never seen anything like it. And and just one last question. I mean, what in the hell is this? What is this? It's a yolk. Get out of my house, man. J Jason! Oh. Chef PB, I just threw up in my mouth and remind me of your cooking. Dear. Oh no! Spare change? Spare change? Uh, spare change, please? Ow! Thank you, sir. Here's a dollar, you bum. Wait, Julia, what are you doing in Los Angeles? Well, I saw your note, so I wanted to come looking for you. Did you make it big yet? No, but it doesn't look like I made it big. I'm on the side of the road begging for change. Well, what happened for cooking for Jason Derulo? I went to his house and I cooked for him, but he kicked me out because the uh, my food was so good. It was so delicious. Uh, he doesn't want to get fat, you know, so he wants to eat disgusting food. Well, you'd be perfect for that. All your food's disgusting. Shut up, Junior! Well, why don't you just go home? Why are you here begging for change? I don't have any money to buy a plane ticket, Junior. Well, why don't we just walk home? Junior, it's 3,000 miles to get home. Well, I run a 15-minute mile at school, so if I do my math right, it only takes about three hours. <laughs> well, we, I guess we should start walking, Junior. Let's walk. Oh, my God, no. Chef PP, I'm hungry. I'm hungry too, Junior, but I don't have any money. I thought Jason was going to pay me. Well, let's eat inside these dumpsters. Junior, I'm not eating out of a dumpster. I have dignity. But I bet you there's a bunch of nice food in there. Not for me. Oh, Chef PP, look, an old McDonald's bag. Maybe somebody left a cheeseburger in there. I'm not eating old food, Junior. Well, I will. There's a cheeseburger in there. Stop there. Chef PP? What? Look inside the bag. Look, I don't want old food. Look, Chef look, look inside the bag. <gasps> what, what, is that a whole lot of cash? Chef PP, we made it. <laughs> yeah. yeah that's what's up. All right, Junior. Look at what we bought with all that cash. Whoa, Chef PP. Can I drive it? Junior. Yes. How else would I dance if I'm driving? <laughs> Shotgun. Yeah. All right, Chef PP. How do I drive it? Turn it on and put the pedal to the floor, Junior. I'm ready to jam. Okay. Oh, now the party started. <laughs> there we go, Junior. All right, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try it. This is so much fun, Chef Pee-Pee. You're flying. Chef Pee-Pee, we made it. I know, we're rich, buddy. Oh, you're looking super fly, Chef Pee-Pee. Oh, you're looking way more fly, Junior. Oh, how much money do you think we have left in our McDonald's bag? Mm, probably a couple thousand. In that, we've been blowing money like whales. Like whales? Yeah, yeah, you know, like like the blowhole that blows water. B blowing money like whales? Yeah, yeah. Okay, whatever. Yeah! Let's go see how much money we have left. Let's go count it. Ooh, let's count it. All right, shit, PP. I'm going to sit back while you dump out all our cash. Way ahead of you, Junior. <sighs> Wait. That's it! That's it! <sighs> How do we blow $50,000 in one day? I don't know. We did rent a McLaren. And we drove it off a cliff. Oh, <laughs> good time. How much were your sunglasses? Uh, 3000 3000 Yeah! How much was your chain? 20000 God, 20000 well, see how we blew that cash. Yeah, we, we did blow a lot of money. Uh -huh. Well, at least we blew someone else's money, not ours. There's <laughs> nothing more fun than blowing someone else's money. Yeah, you're right, Junior. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Who's at the door? I don't know. Let's go answer it with all our cool stuff on. <laughs> you're right. Hello? <laughs> hey. Hey, do you see all the expensive stuff we bought with money we found in a McDonald's bag by a dumpster in LA? Yeah. Yeah, it looks really expensive. Yeah, I feel sorry for the person who left his money there. I mean, finders, keepers, losers, weavers, right? Really? Because I feel sorry for whoever found the money. What? Why would you say that? Well, because the Mafia sent me to find the people who stole their money that was in a McDonald's bag by a dumpster in L.A. 
Uh, well, 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 we've never been to LA. Really? Because that's literally where you just told me you found the money. Uh, oh, you got it mistaken. We found our money in a McDonald's bag by a dumpster in San Francisco. Mm -hmm. Oh, what a coincidence. Wow, what are the odds, right? Yeah, it's a small world. I mean, we, we haven't been to LA. That's like 3,000 miles away. And I would know that because I was just there when I found money in a McDonald's bag. Shut up! Uh, uh, so, uh, what would happen if uh, we don't have that money? Well, then I'm gonna have to break your legs. Uh, break, break our legs? But I don't have legs! Okay, calm down. I'll break your arms. It's fine, okay? We'll work something out. Everybody's gonna get their limbs broken. No one's getting left out. Uh, okay, okay, well, what if we have the money? Well, then you just pay me back and we're good. Uh, okay, uh, Chef Pee, Pee let's go upstairs and grab the money. Dude, we spent all the money. No, we didn't. We put it all on credit cards, remember? Junior, I don't have a credit card. Chef Pee, Pee I'm lying. Come oh. on. Uh, we'll be right back, Mr. Dolphin, okay? Sure, take your time. Oh, no, Junior. I don't want my arms broken. How will I cook? Yeah, maybe you should let him break your arms. Shut up, Junior. Well, look, let's check the McDonald's bag one more time. Maybe there's some money left over there that we didn't see. Oh, I hope so. Come on, please. Oh, look, there's more. That's enough? No, it's not. Just $101? He's not going to accept that. Well, would he accept a copy of 101 Dalmatians? Shut up, Junior. It's not funny. Well, well Chef, look, look. He said, take your time, right? So we can honestly take as long as we need to get the money. I think he was just saying that, Junior. No, no. He said, take your time. So even if it takes us 20 years to raise the $50,000, we can take our time. I guess so. Is that him already? Oh, no, there's no way. That must be the pizza guy or something. Hold on. We didn't order pizza? Uh, hello? Hey, I'm gonna need you to hurry this up. You just said I could take my time. I was being sarcastic. Is that a type of plastic? No. Well, you just said I could take my time, so I thought I had a couple years. No, years? No, you have a couple minutes. Well, you didn't give me a couple minutes. You only gave me a couple seconds. You're like a hospital in Antarctica. You have no patience. Okay, that was pretty good, so I'll give you one minute. Uh, one minute to get the money? Yeah, and then I'll break your legs after that. But if I give you the money, you'll break my legs? No, if you don't give me the money, I'll break your legs. Okay, just g give me one minute. <laughs> All right, Chef PB, I got a plan. But what's the plan, Junior? I right, put this money in the bag and then give it to me. Okay. It's a foolproof plan. All right, I got the McDonald's bag with money in it. Oh, okay, that's great. Hey, but before you grab it, you have to promise that no matter what's in this bag, you'll never come back. Well, there has to be money in it. No, I promise on my life that there's money in this McDonald's bag. So once you grab this bag and you see the money, you'll never come back. Well, I don't know why I'd need to, so sure, yeah. All right, so here's the bag with money in it. Okay. All right, never come back. <laughs> All right, Chef PB, I dealt with it. Wait, you did? Yeah, he left and said he'll never come back. Really? Yep, he's completely happy. <sighs> Hold on, let me see what that's about. Mm. Uh, hello? What? You? What are you doing here? Yeah, there's $101 in here. Yeah? Well, well when you gave me the bag, I kind of assumed there'd be $50,000 in here, because that's how much was originally in here. Well, I never said there was $50,000 in there. I said there was money in the McDonald's bag, and you accepted it. You said you would never come back if there was money in the McDonald's bag. Well, yeah, that, that's true. I did say that. Yeah, and you assumed, and you gotta learn to never assume, because when you assume, that makes what? It makes a bad word out of you and me. Exactly. So you agreed that whatever amount of money was in that bag, you would leave. You didn't specify how much. Yeah, that, that's true. This is kind of my fault, too. Yeah, so I, I, I'm in the clear. Yeah, I, I'm sorry. I, I'll, I'll go talk to my boss about this. Yeah, so see you later. <laughs> All right, Chef PB, he's gone forever. <laughs> Wait, really? Yeah, he was happy with the money. No way, Jose. Yes way, Pepe. No, no, Pablo. Hey, what, what are you doing here? Well, I sent one of my men to come collect my money, but apparently you guys found a loophole while I was busy spanking poop holes. And I want to know what you guys did with my $50,000. Well, we we spent it all. Ow! You spent it all? You think just because I like to store my money in a McDonald's bag right beside a dumpster that you guys can just spend all my money? Well, we thought it like was just random money or McDonald's money. Well, the M on the bag didn't stand for McDonald's. It stands for Mr. Goodman. And that's my $50,000. And you'll give me $50,000 right now! Well, we, we don't have the money. Chevy, why don't you cook for him? Junior, my cooking sucks. It better be a $50,000 meal. Chevy, your cooking actually doesn't suck. It's actually really amazing. Look, you cook for Jason Rulo. You've cooked for so many awesome people. Look, I know you can do it. Come on, Chevy. Just dig deep down and cook an amazing meal. I guess so. You're right, Junior. I'll try. Where's my food? Here you go. <gasps> Is that a blue waffle? Chevy, you're supposed to make something good. I used to eat this all the time as a kid. My mom had a blue waffle. Oh, it was my favorite. 
You know what, guys? I'll, I'll forgive the $50,000. This right here just brings me back to my childhood. So, guys, don't worry about the $50,000. i am going to take this home. I'm going to eat it. It's going to be the best. Chef, you didn't even cook anything new. That's the same food from the other day, isn't it? Yep. Hey, Daddy, can we have pizza for dinner? No, Jeffy. Why not? Jeffy, use your inside voice. This is my inside voice. No, it's not. You use your inside voice. Jeffy, I'm only yelling because you're yelling. I'm only yelling because you said we can't have pizza for dinner. Well, I'm the adult, so I make the rules. Well, your rules suck. Well, Jeffy, don't say the S word. The S word? Suck? Yeah. Oh, I thought the S word was yep. Chicago. And I hear they have good pizza there, and that's what I want for dinner. Well, well Jeffy, Chicago starts with a C, and you shouldn't say the C word either. Oh, I thought the C word was Kentucky. And they have fried chicken there, which is what I don't want for dinner. I want pizza. Well, well Jeffy, Kentucky starts with a K. Oh, it starts with a K? I thought knife started with a K. Jeffy, that, that's pronounced knife. Um, no, it's pronounced knife. See, this is the word knife right here. See, it has a K right there. Well, Jeffy, it's pronounced knife. No, it's not. There's a K, so you pronounce it knife. Well, Jeffy, the K is silent. You, you want to know what's not silent? What? My inside, boys, because I want pizza for dinner. Oh, Jeffy, look, I'm going to go in the kitchen and see if I can find pizza, okay? And if you don't find pizza, then you're going to hear more of my inside, voice, because I want pizza. All right, Jeffy, I'll go find pizza. Good. I'm going to go talk to Junior. Tell him we're having pizza for dinner. <sighs> okay, I'm finally done inflating my big inflatable airplane. I'm so lightheaded. Hey, Junior, guess what we're having for dinner? Because of me. What? Pizza. Oh, yeah, I love pizza. We're having pizza for dinner because of Jeffy. How'd you get that to happen? Well, Junior, I used my manners. I walked up to my daddy and I said, Father, may we please have pizza for supper? And he said, No, Jeffy. And I said, Catch these hands. Hold my weed, daddy. And so we started throwing hands. And long story short, we're having pizza for dinner. Oh, my God, I love pizza. Well, you want to go throw this big inflatable airplane around? Yep. All right, let's go do it. <laughs> What's up, Mario? Oh, hey, Bowser. What'd you get to eat? Homemade cheeseburger and fries. Chef Pee Pee went all out. Oh, well, I'm going to see if Chef Pee Pee can make me some pizza. Oh, cool. Hey, quick question. Are you still jealous about my first place Mario Kart trophy? No, I'm not jealous about it, Bowser. That was years ago. Yeah, you're still jealous. <laughs> it's a prized possession. Maybe one day you'll get a first place trophy. I have plenty of those. Yeah, not this one. <laughs> I'm going to go up to my room. <laughs> <sighs> All right, Junior, you ready to send it? Yep, runway 69 is ready for landing. 69er, prepare for both of us to be satisfied. Oh no, my dad's trophy! Houston, we have a problem. But that's space, Jeffy, not airlines. Boop, boop, pull up. Boop, boop, pull up. Yeah, that's airlines. <laughs> Oh no, my dad loved this trophy. Obviously not, because he had it sitting on an airport runway. Yeah, we were cleared for landing. It was kind of irresponsible. What was that noise? That sounds like my trophy. Uh, Rod, Jeffy, my dad's coming. What was that noise? <laughs> my trophy! Who would do such a thing? What was that noise? Oh, uh, you! I knew you were jealous of my trophy. Well, I didn't do this. Then who did? Well, someone probably threw that big inflatable airplane at it. Yeah, you, because you were jealous. Well, no, I don't even know where to get a big inflatable airplane like that at. I don't even know where that came from. Probably online. You probably went to Amazon Prime and, and had it shipped here. I don't know if you have a membership or not. Well, look, I, I did not do that. I don't know what happened. Then who did? Well, Okay, well, maybe someone broke into the house and threw that plane at your trophy. Broke into the house, brought an inflatable plane, and threw it at my trophy? Yeah, maybe they were trying to distract you so they could steal your TV or something. Distract me for my TV? Wait, that does sound realistic. You know what? I have to put up some cameras because this, this world is getting dangerous. Well, no, 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 Bowser, obviously I'm lying. Maybe one of our kids threw it. No one broke in the house and threw a plane at your trophy. Look, look, look. Somebody's trying to steal my TV. I got to get some cameras now, Mario. Well, well, look, I'm going to tell my son to stay inside for the rest of his life. You do the same for your son, okay? Because this world is too dangerous. Oh, oh. Unless you just want to admit that you broke it. Well, I, I did not break it. I'm going to go tell my son to stay inside forever, too. Hmm. Exactly. Oh man, Jeffy, I can't believe we broke my dad's trophy. Do you think he noticed? No. Junior! Yes. 
Uh, Junior! Uh, uh, Don't forget to use your manners, Junior. What is the matter, Father? Look, Junior, I want you to stay in the house for the rest of your life. But why? Because somebody broke in and threw an inflatable plane and broke my trophy. Uh, well, what if hypothetically me and Jeffy did it? Oh, I would just send you back to military school. Well, we definitely didn't do that, did we, Jeff? We didn't do that. Nope. Mm -mm. Well, I'm glad to hear it. Look, Junior, it's a dangerous world out there. I just don't want you to go outside ever again. I'm going to tell Chef Pee, Pee to let me know if you ever do so you can go to military school, okay? Well, that sucks. Hey, hey, hey. Don't use the F word. You know what? Stand in the corner. Yes, sir. Mm-hmm. <sighs> Jeffy, I need to talk to you. What is the matter, father? You're not allowed to go outside ever again. That's fair. But while we're making up these BS rules, you're not allowed to talk ever again. Jeffy, I'm being serious. Me too, stop talking. Jeffy, I can talk. Shut up. Jeffy, I am day, allowed. Day, hush. I'm allowed to talk. Shut up. Jeffy, I can talk. No, you're not. Stop talking. Well, then you're not allowed to talk. Okay, Jeffy, we can talk. Dang, shut your mouth. Jeffy, I can talk. Stop talking! Okay, then you can't go outside. Okay, that's fine, so shut up. Okay, good, we, we, we got Stop it. talking, Dad, I don't understand why you keep talking. Oh, we have an agreement. Shut your mouth. Just don't go outside. Hush. There, the security camera set up. Now we'll know if anyone's trying to break in and steal my television. I don't think anybody wants your television, Bowser. Oh, I know they do. I want to watch my Charlie, though. They can have it. <laughs> hey, Junior, how long are you in your corner for? I don't know. Hmm. Well, why don't you just leave? I can't. Sure you can. All you gotta do is just get up and walk away. Hey, uh, hey, Junior? What? Joe Shep huh, is calling. Joseph's calling? Okay, I have to answer. I have to leave the corner and answer it. Mm -hmm. Uh, hello? What's up, dude? What's up, Joseph? Say what's up, Jeffy. Shut up. Dude, hurry up and get to the playground. Underneath this slide, I got tacos and chalupas! What, tacos and chalupas? I love tacos and chalupas! I'll be right there! <sighs> What, dude? I'm not allowed to go, Joseph. Wait, why? My dad said I'm never allowed to leave the house again. Dude, just sneak out or something. Oh, okay, look, Joseph, I'm gonna go ask my dad for permission, and if he says yes, I'll come. Dude, hurry up. The tacos and chalupas are gonna get cold. Okay, I'll be there no matter what. I'll be there soon. All right, Jeff, you have to sneak out the house. I can't go, Junior. Why not? Because I made a deal with my daddy that I won't leave the house if he doesn't talk anymore, and that's a pretty sick deal. But, like, come on. It's, choco it's tacos and chalupas. Hmm... But it's also my daddy not talking anymore because his voice is annoying. But it's tacos and chalupas under the slide. Hmm. All right, let's do it, Junior. All right, let's go. Let's sneak out. Oh, man, Jeffy, I can't believe we're sneaking out. I know. Our parents are so stupid. I know. They actually think that we're going to listen to them and not sneak out of the house. What are you doing? Oh, nothing. All right, all right let's go be Joseph. All right. What's up, Joseph? What's up, dudes? Oh, you were able to sneak out the house? Well, our parents said no. But we said yes. Oh, ho, ho, that's sick. We'll help yourself to some tacos and chalupa. Man, Joseph, that's a lot of Taco Bell. I know. My cousin works in the drive-thru, so you know I'm hooked up. My butthole's about to be on fire tonight. Oh, do you have any hot or mild sauce? Oh, bro, I have some fire sauce. I'm about to poop all over the toilet seat tonight. Yeah! But I was going to do that anyway. Oh, man, I can't wait to poop in the bushes. I can't wait to clog the toilet and make Chevy be clean it. <laughs> Let's eat all these tacos. Yeah, dude, tacos. <laughs> oh, man, Joseph, these tacos taste amazing. Yeah, these tacos taste pee-pee. Well, I don't want to eat it if it tastes pee-pee. <laughs> Get it, guys, because it's pee-pee? Well, speaking of pee-pee, Chef Pee-pee's calling me. Oh, everyone, be quiet. I have to answer the phone. Oh, okay, dude. Uh, hello? Oh, these are good tacos. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. Junior, where are you? Uh, I'm in my room. In your room, huh? Yeah, I'm in my, I'm in my room, just laying in bed. Stop lying, Junior. I know you're not in your room. I'm in there right now. Well, are you sure you're checking the right room? I'm in the room right now, Junior. Uh, oh, uh, well, uh, I'm sorry I lied. I'm on the roof. What? what, what? You, you know you're not supposed to leave the house, Junior. Well, your dad said you can't leave the house, so get back inside. Oh, okay, I'll be back in like 30 minutes. Look, you have 10 seconds to get back in this house, or I'm going to tell your daddy. <gasps> <laughs> Joseph, oh, we gotta go. Jeffy, come on, go, 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 go. Oh, okay, dude. Okay, Jeffy, we have to get inside before my dad notices. I can't believe all this is happening just because we broke my dad's trophy. What are you waving at? Oh, what is that? Is that a security camera? I think so. Oh, no. Jeffy, we have to break that. My dad cannot hear what we just said. I'm on it, Junior. Yeah, break it. All right, Jeffy, I need you to break that security camera. All right, Junior, I'm gonna use my Fortnite pickaxe. All right, break it. All right, here we go. You ready? Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, I, I think it's broken. All right, good work, Jeffy. Now let's get inside. All right. All right, Jeffy, we made it back inside the house and we didn't get caught. Junior, we were too smooth. There's no way we're gonna get caught. Well, well, well. Uh, Junior, where were you? Uh, me and Jeffy were playing hide and seek in the attic, which is still inside the house, so we didn't, we didn't go outside. Oh, really? Well, Chef PP showed me this video, and I am disappointed. Oh, man, Jeffy, I can't believe we're sneaking out. Uh, I know, our parents are so stupid. Stupid, I huh? I think we're gonna listen to them and not sneak out of the house. <laughs> What are you doing? Oh, nothing. All right. Okay. You were waving at the camera? Uh -huh. Okay, Jeffy. We have to get inside before my dad notices. I can't believe all this is happening just because we broke my dad's trophy. What are you waving at? Ah! What is that? Is that a security camera? I think so. Uh, oh, no. Jeffy. Dad. Break that. Dad, that's not me. Just... No, no. Shush. I want to hear it. You're breaking it. All right, Jeffy. I need you to break that security camera. All right, Junior. I'm going to use my Fortnite pickaxe. All right, break it. All right, here we go. The pickaxe, huh? Yeah. Nice. Uh, Junior, you know you're grounded, right? And you're going to military school. But no, Dad, that wasn't us. That was someone trying to frame us. Oh, don't lie to me, Junior. Uh, don't lie to me. You broke my trophy, and then you're going to break my camera, too? Well, I mean, uh, no, no, I don't want to hear it. Technically, I didn't break the trophy. Jeffy did. Way to throw me under the bus, Junior. You know what, Junior? I'm just so mad. Go and stand in that corner right now. Okay. Mm -hmm. And while you're standing in the corner, I'm going to get the number for the military school. I'm sorry you're standing in the corner, Junior. Uh, what's going on in here? Junior broke my trophy. But he broke your trophy? Excellent. <laughs> um, Danny, I don't think my friend getting in trouble is worth this hundred bucks, so you can have it back. Wait, Jeffy, stick to the plan. Wait, what plan? You better tell him the truth, Danny, before I do. Uh, uh, uh Jeffy doesn't know what he's talking about. Uh, J Jeffy needs to shut up. I, 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 you I, need to tell him, uh, Danny. Uh, 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 Tell me what? Okay, fine, Bowser. I was jealous of your trophy. Wait, you were? I, I knew you were. And, and and I'm the one who broke your trophy. Wait, you broke it? I thought Junior broke it. No, I framed him. I made it look like your son did it. See, the truth is, I sent uh, an inflatable airplane to your son in the mail, and I knew he was going to invite Jeffy to play with him. And then when Jeffy had the airplane, I, I paid him $100 to throw it at your trophy. And then when the trophy hit the ground, it didn't break, so I took a hammer to it. I, I'm a fraud. I, I'm jealous of your trophy, and I can't pay my house payment, but I'm somehow slipping Jeffy $100 bills. How am I doing that? Yeah, so I was jealous of your trophy, and I just didn't want you to know. Well, I'm just glad you admitted it. <laughs> You were jealous, you were jealous. I'm forever number one, so it doesn't matter if it's broken or not. <laughs> guys, am I still grounded? Or... Guys? Hey, fat boy, you wanna fight? Yeah. You wanna fight? Okay. You wanna fight? What? Hey, fat boy, you wanna fight? All right. You wanna fight? That's right. You wanna fight? Good night. Hey, fat boy. You wanna fight? Get out. You wanna fight? Oh man, oh man, oh man! Charlie and Friends is on! It's my favorite show ever! Charlie and Friends was filmed in front of a live audience. <laughs> Hi, guys. I'm Charlie. And today, I'm home alone. You know what that means. I'm gonna play with myself. <laughs> gotta get ready. Oh yeah, gotta get ready. Oh, I'm about to play with myself so hard. <sighs> now what game do I wanna play by myself? Oh, Miss Pac-Man. <laughs> oh, look at me, playing with myself. By myself. <laughs> Oh, oh, Charlie, I thought you were talking about something else. <laughs> I wouldn't mind watching that either. <laughs> How do you come up with this stuff? Oh, genius, comedic genius. Hey, all you Charlie and Friends fans out there, do I have a contest for you? Who wants to sign a pair of my underwear? Yes, yes. Oh, I've been dreaming for this day, yes. And not just any pair of my underwear. Hold on. Oh, witchy. <laughs> this pair. I've had these on since the very first episode of Charlie and Friends. 
Oh, and I haven't washed them. God. And they can belong to you. Yes! Charlie, I need those. Give them to me, please. And you're probably wondering, <clears throat> how do I win these? Well, all you have to do is call me and tell me how much you love me. And if I believe you, you win. I'll be waiting by my phone. That's all I gotta do? I can tell you how much I love you. I love you every day. Where's my phone? Where's my phone? I can call. I'm getting a phone call. Hello? This is Camille Habib Habab, and I want to put your underwear on my doorknobs. Well, how much do you love me? Oh, uh, as much as a camel loves water? Uh, not good enough. Uh, bye. God, next caller. Um, what? Come on, come on, answer me. <laughs> I'm getting another phone call. <coughs> uh, hello? Hi, this is Mr. Goodman, and I would like to buy your underwear. Uh, they're not for sale. How much do you love me? I don't love anyone. I only love my money, so I would like to buy your underwear. Well, they're not for sale. Ugh. Next caller. Stop answering other people. Answer me. Another caller. Hopefully this one loves me. Hello? Please tell me you love me. Oh, Charlie, it's me. Bowser, your biggest fan. Oh, I love you so much. I love you. I love you. Oh, I, I would do anything for you. I would put my kid up for adoption for you. I, I would eat my own toenails. Oh, I love you. Whoa. Sounds like that fan loves me. <laughs> Looks like we have our winner, guys. Congratulations, Bauer. <laughs> you get the underwear. <coughs> yes! I won the underwear! Oh, man. About to cook dinner. Chef BB, I won the underwear! What? I won the underwear! Ow, Bowser! Oh, I won the underwear! Oh, I need to get a new job. Hey, Junior, I only got four fingers. Watch out with that. I want the underwear! You want underwear? Yes! Is that a good thing? Yes! Pee-pee! Exactly, pee-pee in the underwear! I want the underwear! That must be the underwear! <laughs> Hello, do you have my underwear? Congratulations, you're the winner of Charlie's used underoos. Oh, man, I'm the only one that can smell now. <laughs> in the kitchen right now! Oh, what, Bowser? What do you want, Dad? You see these beautiful pair of underwear right here, signed by Charlie? Ew, Dad, why do you have that? Because I won them in a contest! And I want to hang them up right here in the kitchen so every time I eat, I can see them. Ew, Dad, why would you want that? Because they're special to me! Look, look, you better not touch them, okay? If you touch them, oh, you're going to lose all your video games and toys for the rest of your life! And Chef Pee, -Pee if you touch them, you're going to clean the toilet with your tongue! You got that? Yeah, I understand, Dad. Oh, whatever, Bowser. <sighs> what did your dad want, Junior? He wanted to tell me not to touch a smelly underwear that's hanging up in the kitchen. Why would he do that? I don't know why he'd do that. Hey, Junior, you want to have a food fight in the kitchen? <gasps> I've never had a food fight before. Yeah, let's have a food fight. BB. Junior, Jesse, your dinner's ready. Oh, man, perfect timing. Now we can have our food fight. And it's ravioli, so it's really messy. Ew, there's green beans on it. I hate green beans, Junior. But I'll start the food fight. Food fight! Yeah! Oh no, Jeffy! What? Oh no, I'm in so much trouble! Those are some dirty underwear, Junior. They need to learn how to use the bathroom. Jeffy, do you know what you just did? I sent it hard. No, you threw ravioli all over my dad's signed underwear. Why did your dad got dirty underwear all over the wall? Junior, what did you do? Well, I didn't do it, Chef PP. Jeffy did it. Well, he wanted to have a food fight. Well Oh, you know what? I'm just gonna tell your daddy you're going to get grounded. <gasps> Bowser! There's just some sharp, Jimmy. Get me! Let Jimmy tie him up, tie him up. All right. <laughs> Junior, let me go and untie me right now. No, you're gonna tell my dad get me grounded. But then he's gonna find out anyway. Untie me! Oh, well, then I'll let you out when he finds out. How about that? No, no, no. Junior, untie me. Untie me. Uh, close it, Jeffy. Untie All me right, right now. <laughs> All right, so we'll get him out whenever we have fixed underwear, okay? Oh. Okay, now that we got rid of Chef Pee, Pee, we have to find a way to fix this underwear before my dad sees. Well, why don't we just put it in the washing machine? That washes clothes. You're a genius, Jeffy! Well, I think with my head and not with my butt. All right, let's put him in the washing machine. Oh. All right, Jeffy, I think it's done being clean. Wait, where are they at? Okay, they're there. Oh, look, they're good as new! 
pee pee. Now all we have to do is hang them back on the wall and my dad will never notice. See Junior, when something goes bad, there's always a good. Yeah, let's go. There, they look perfect. My dad will never notice. We did it. We did it. Yeah. No eating here tonight. No we, eating here tonight. We're we gonna die. We, we, uh, Jeffy, uh, Jeffy. Uh, I know we did it. Uh, uh. Uh, 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 Jeffy, we did it. We, we didn't do it, Jeffy. What? Look, the signature's gone. Oh, well, it must have just ran away. Well, no, my dad cares about the signature. It was signed by Charlie, his most, his most favorite person ever. Well, why don't we just get another signature? Because he's super famous. I, I don't know how to get another signature from him. We well, just go to his house. I mean, that seems to be what people like to do these days. We'll just show up at his house and get a signature. Well, uh, okay, we'll, just, yeah, we'll do that. We'll, we'll Google his address and show up to his house, and he'll sign it. Okay, let's go. Let's do it. <laughs> Okay, Jeffy, Google says that Charlie lives at this address. I don't think I'll have any problem with us just randomly showing up. Yeah, me either. So we're gonna go up there, ask him to sign this underwear, and we'll be good. Okay, and I'm also gonna ask him for some free stuff. Yeah, let's do it! Oh man, Jeffy, I'm so nervous, I don't know what to say to him. Jeffy? Jeffy? What? I said I'm so nervous, I don't know what to say to him. What? Take the Sharpie out of your ear. What? I said I'm so nervous, I don't know what to say to him. Oh, I'm gonna ask him if I can live with him. That's a good idea. Okay, so how, how should I knock? Oh, I'll show you. Please, open up! Hold on, I'm coming, I'm coming. Oh, hello. I'm Charlie. <laughs> Why aren't you cheering? Oh, oh, oh. Ooh, yeah! Ooh. What are you guys doing in my house? Can I live with you? Uh, we were wondering if you could uh, sign a pair of your underwear. What? A pair of my underwear? What are you doing with that? Well, I mean, we won in a contest. <laughs> Get them here! They're mine! We, we, we need you to sign those! Oh, no way! Get off my property before I call the cops! <laughs> Who's laughing? What? Hey! You can't take those! We need those back! What are we gonna do, Junior? Well, now we have to get a pair of his underwear! Um, oh, I got an idea! Come on, Jeff!